All right guys, what's going on? How are we doing today? Been doing a couple things already today, but now I'm moving on to an extremely exciting part and that is my fan recipe of the week. All right guys, so we just got in the store. I got this awesome recipe. Gonna be making some donuts, don't you know? <laughs> Uh, I'm gonna need to get the ingredients. Eggs, eggs we have back at Quest, so we're good on eggs. This recipe also calls for Greek yogurt, which I actually have at work. Calls for a little coconut flour, so we're gonna use a little bit of that. Oh man, wrong aisle. All right, so the last big thing that I need, uh, it calls for a nut butter. Doesn't really specify. Always been a fan of using Skippy. No hydrogenated or par partially hydrogenated oils of any sort. That's it, I got everything that I need. We're gonna get to checking out. Guess what? Time to get back to the kitchen, because it's time for some donuts. Seriously, I'm starving. All right, guys, so I'm back over here at Quest. So first thing I need, nice big mixing bowl. I got the oven on 350 degrees at the moment. So first thing I'm gonna do is get all my wet ingredients going. I told you guys this before, wet and then dry. I made one substitution on this whole recipe. My girl Josie May had used canned pumpkin. I'm using light sour cream. So we got two tablespoons going in. Now I got almond milk. I'm gonna use two tablespoons, unsweetened. All right, this next one gets a little tricky. So I'm gonna use literally one tablespoon of an egg. So what I'm gonna do here is I'm gonna go ahead, crack this egg into a bowl. I'm gonna whisk it up so I get the whites and the, uh, and the yolks incorporated. All right, awesome. So now I got my, uh, my eggs. Here we go. So like I said, got this awesome nut butter right here, natural skippy peanut butter. I'm gonna whisk this together with everything else and then we're gonna start adding all the dry ingredients. Now I'm gonna switch it up just so you know to a uh, spatula because now that I got my wets and the dries are gonna start going in, the batter's probably gonna get a little on the thicker side, so I don't want it all to get stuck up in the whisk. Do the same if you're gonna do this because you don't wanna be banging out that whisk and then you're splattering dough all over the place. All right, so next up we got some baking powder. A little bit of coconut flour. You hear that noise? That's the sound of donuts. All right, got that good vanilla protein powder. That's gonna do it for the batter for the donuts themselves. So what we're gonna do is we're just gonna bring this together. All right guys, so here we go. We got the donuts all laid out, they're formed. So I couldn't find any parchment paper. Uh, so instead I just went ahead and sprayed the sheet pan. Got a little non-stick spray right there. And like I said, I'm gonna slap these out. That didn't work. We're gonna get my cosmetic tool. Boom, a little offset spatula always does the trick. All right, so epic fail. Bound to happen at some point, right? So what I'm gonna do is grab some gloves, rework this. All right, so I reformed my donuts and we're time to get them in the oven. All right, so very simple frosting recipe. First thing we're gonna do, two tablespoons of water. Next up, we got one tablespoon of Greek yogurt. And lastly, the star of this frosting, a little chocolate protein powder. By yours truly, Quest. So in the meantime, waiting on these donuts to finish. As soon as they come out, we're gonna frost them up, get that taste test, can't wait. All right guys, so. Donuts all done, frosted up, looking good. I'm super psyched right now. My donut right here, the macros that I came out with, per donut we got 114 calories, 12.5 grams of protein, pretty damn good, seven grams of carbs, and five grams of fat. All right, so check it out. Boom, good, time to eat. Mmm, telling you. What do you guys think, finish it in one bite? Yeah, do it. Okay. That was awesome. Super happy the way it came out. Josie, you did an awesome job. Remember, if you guys want to uh, get the recipe, go check out Josie's page, at VM Fitness. If you want to subscribe to me, go ahead and click on the donut. See if you can catch it. See if you can get over here at me. And uh, I'll see you guys next time, all right?